I am going to do a review about the G diaper now. Um, I tried the G diaper during my second attempt at cloth diapering. I think it was the first one that I bought and I was lucky enough to get it second hand for I think only $10. Um, it has a shell and this little plastic insert that you clip in and then the whole point of it is these like disposable things which I'm like what's the point of cloth that I bring if you're just going to use disposable things every time anyways. So I would just use a regular insert and I don't actually have one to show you because I took it and I threw it and I said you just get out of here and just never even come back. I hate you. I hate your guts because it sucked. It was the worst, dumbest, stupidest thing in the world. Never buy one of these things. They are a waste of money. They retail for like 30 or $36 for a pack of two of them, which is just way too much for basically a disposable diaper with like a terrible idea and a fantastic marketing team. Um, like I said, there's this weird like little plastic, just picture like a regular diaper shell, a regular diaper shell, just like any other one, except there's like buttons, four buttons, and this little weird plastic shell that you can just wipe out clips in. So you're like, whoa, that's a great idea. It's like, no matter what they do, pee, poo, whatever, you wipe this thing out and like you're good to go. You put another thing in. It seems like a genius idea. And for somebody who doesn't really know a lot about cloth diapering, um, doesn't have like the first time experience, you're going to get sucked in and think it's a great idea. And you can end up spending kind of a lot of money on it. Um, oh, now that I know, obviously, more about the design and structure of cloth diapers, they are terrible. Like, they are literally the worst thing ever. I wish I had one to show you, but, like, it's not allowed in my house. It's gone. It is, yeah, it's been told. So, anyways, it sits terribly. There's, like, a huge gap where it just 100% leaks through. The shell is not, have, like, a PUL lamination or anything, so it's not waterproof. It's counting on this weird little, like, inside middle section to be waterproof, but it's, like this much smaller on each, like, it's just the dumbest thing ever. It's terrible. Just never buy it, trust me. I'm not, I'm not gonna show you, you don't need to know, you don't need to go any further. Trust that I will not lie to you. Don't waste your money. It is a zero out of five, a zero out of 10 for everything. They're stupid. They're awful. And they do up backwards. I had my son wearing it wrong for like the first week until I watched like a little video or something. And they do up on the back. Like imagine a squiggly, squirmy baby like trying to get these stupid things and then you're trying to like adjust it and you're all new and you're like, I don't know if I have it on right, I just want to like do another adjustment. But they're like under its butt. Like it's just, oh, oh I don't know, it stresses me out thinking about it. I never want to think about it again. I'm never going to. This is the last time I ever say the word G diaper. G for get out of my life. Peace out.